Hey gang, what's up? Welcome back here to another edition of The Fishing Teacher, and thanks a lot for stopping by to check today's video. It's always much appreciated. Guys, today we're gonna to be talking about one of what I think is one of the biggest mysteries in fishing, and that is during the winter time, like you know, November, December, January, February, when you get an unseasonably warm day, um, it just, the fish don't bite very good when it's unseasonably warm in the winter time, which doesn't make a lot of sense to me. So I'm gonna give you guys sort of my theory and my experience on this. It might help you guys uh, catch a few down the, down the road if you uh, encounter these situations out there. Now, before we get started guys, I wanna remind you about our November sale on my Solar Bat, my RB2, RB3 series, the new Signature Series sunglasses from Solar Bat. This is what the ones with our new crystallized matte gray lens that reduces the light reflection. If you buy a pair this month of the new RB3s, buy one, get one free, man. You can't beat that. You get two pairs of the RB, RB3 series. Um, you guys will absolutely love these glasses. Just, uh, just love wearing them. So check it out. I'll put the link in the description of this video. <clears throat> okay, guys, here's one of the things that I have noticed in bass fishing, uh, specifically uh, since I've been paying attention to it over the past 30 years or so. That is, let's say when you're fishing like this time of year, during the winter, late fall during the winter or late fall, something like that, when the water temperatures are starting to get colder, if you get one of those days where say there's a warm front pushing in and say the water, say that say the air temperature is 10 degrees above normal, you get one of those days, it's just beautiful to be out, uh, you know, unseasonably warm and you wanna go fishing because it's so nice out. And then you go fishing and more times than not, it's been my experience, that the fishing just sucks. It's like the weather's beautiful and you think because the weather's beautiful, the fish ought to be more active. And guys, I bet probably, you know, 98% of the time when I go fishing, when that water temperature's cold <clears throat> on an unseasonably warm day, I'm just not gonna catch many fish. I've always figured out, you know, fig I've always figured that that would activate those fish for some reason since they're cold blooded, but it doesn't work that way. Guys, for me, it's like bass react to weather conditions very similar to how they do in any other conditions. They like low light conditions and nastier conditions. So in the winter time, I always do better. If I go out there and it's, you know, cold or, or you know, it's, it's normal temperatures for the year or even below normal temperatures. And it's, if it's cloudy and you got a little bit of wind and it's just not that comfortable to be out there, you're sort of cold all day long. It just, the fish just bite better. <clears throat> it just activates the fish. It has to do something with the combination of the light intensity, I think, breaking up the surface. It has to do uh, a little bit with, you know, how the fish don't react instantly to a temperature change that we think they will. But it just seems like to me the fish bite better on those sort of nastier, miserable type days, even in the winter time. I mean, it's like this during a lot during the whole year, especially, and also, you know, extends over to the winter time. Now, I think what happens a lot of times <clears throat> is we, we think just because it's a warm day that these fish are gonna completely change their mood and personality. And they're gonna go from being in this cold weather mode to all of a sudden being super active because the air temperature is so much warmer. But in reality, what happens is the water temperatures don't warm up that much. Let's say, for example, you've got water temperature in January of 48 degrees in the lake you're fishing. If you get one of those days where it happens to be, say your norm, your normal temperature is 55 degrees, and you get one of those days in December, January, where the temp it's just 75, 78 degrees, and you get out there and you say, God, it just feels so good to be out here. Water's gonna be warming up. Guys, the water doesn't warm up that much because this time of year we have very short daylight hours. So by the time the sun gets up and starts to heat up, you've got maybe like a four hour window, maybe three, three to four hour window when it's, where it's warm and it feels really good to be out there. And then about three o'clock in the afternoon, sun starts dropping down, temperatures start dropping, waters just don't, doesn't warm up. So those fish do not react as quick as what we think they are. So that's why it doesn't really help help the fish fishing out any is when you go fishing during those warm days. And most of the time, those unseasonably warm days are temporary. You don't have like weeks of it that will really considerably raise the water temperature. So my advice guys is like, if you get one of those nice days out there, 
Um, go do something else, man. Do some yard work or go play some golf because if you go to the lake, you're probably going to struggle. You know, it's always good to go fishing, but don't expect to catch a lot because for whatever reason, it just sort of has a negative effect on them. So anyway, guys, just wanted to run that by you. Just uh, be aware of that and hope it helps. We'll talk to you all later.